I think of ourselves as tubular organisms. The inner tubular organism has your spinal cord, your psoas, your adrenals, and your kidneys. So in some ways, psoas should be perceived as an organ of perception. muscular capacity, but it is an organ of perception. It communicates. It tells us things. It informs us. It shapes us. It expresses. These are what psoas is. You know, it can't be seen or understood in the biomechanical story. So when I met embryology, I went, oh my God, this is what I'm sensing. This is tells the story of what I'm experiencing internally, because I'm not a researcher. I'm a somatic, I, I do movement and my body is the book, you know, it's, it's informing me. And then I find like, well, what am I talking about? Or what am I sensing? And I'm looking for people. So embryology tells a different story. It tells a story of the cell, of living process, not object. Cadavers are objects at this point. They're forms, they're shape, they're what's left. Embryology is a living process. It's about how do we keep reshaping our cells dissolve? How do we keep showing up as Liz? You know, like, how does that happen? Um, and it's an infolding and an unfolding and a constant conversation. So spine isn't a column. It's not a structure. It's a living river. It's a, it's a tubular organism like a caterpillar. The earliest vertebral creature on the planet that we have found is the sea squirt. It's the pre, uh, pre, 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 bleh, pre vertebral organism, meaning it's the rudimentary spine, spinal cord. It's five billion years old or something. I don't know, maybe it's the millions. Millions or billions gets pretty big for me. But it's, it's a creature that we are actually a fluid organism and now we're on land. And so when we return to this idea of thinking of psoas as an organ of perception, rather than trying to put it in one of those conceptual boxes, because that's what they are, they're boxes uh, of, you know, this is what this is, you know, naming the object and look at ourselves as a living process. Then we start relating to the core of our being as the Taoists call the psoas is the muscle of your soul. Thank you.